What's up, nigga? It's your boy, Connor 85, and I'm back again on the channel. How are you lot doing? Hopefully, you're all right all over the world. USA, Canada, Germany, what's happening? Japan, what is up as well? Shout out to you guys. And yeah, today we've got a special video, guys. It's a Supreme and Nike SB Dunk High. It's called the No Means Necessary as well. So before I continue, guys, make sure you subscribe. To pick your pardon. Hit the bell notification. And also make sure you give this video a thumbs up as well so we can go up the algorithm as well. And don't forget to also subscribe because when I get to 10K, I'm going to give three different cash prizes. I'm going to give one person some Nike Dunk High brand new. They actually call the Michigans brand new DS as well. Then I'm going to give a per another person £50. And then the other person will probably get £20 as well. So all you got to do is subscribe to my YouTube channel and also follow me on my Instagram handle. And then screenshot both of those things that you've just done there. And then inbox me on my uh, Instagram. And that's it. All done, pretty much. So we'll take our information from Supreme League News. So what we'll do is we'll start screen recording. So you guys can see what I'm looking at exactly. So, bam, as you guys can see there, you're greeted by that two-tone colorway Nike SB Dunk High. Um, I actually own a Nike SB Dunk High one pair. And one thing I can say is these are very thick. And also they've got a thicker sole as well, a thicker midsole, which has got a lot of cushion because it's a shoe that's designed for skaters to actually take outside and use it, you know, um, on a on a daily basis if you skate every day. So uh, compared to the normal Nike Dunk High, the Nike Dunk Highs feel very thin and you know they can get a bit painful when you use them quite a lot to walk. So, anyways, focusing on the shoe, guys. This comes in this like very bright white and also this black colorway as well and you've also got no as well and the heart as well so apparently the heart comes from i love new york as well which a lot of tourists tend to buy and you know um this just says no love so basically i guess it speaks a message of the the hard streets of new york that there's no love and people try and make it in new york on my hat on manhattan in new york by any means necessary as well so it's kind of got that sort of like, you know, uh, street sort of message as well, which I'm pretty sure doesn't represent all of New York, just certain parts, which if you find yourself there, you may be scared for your life. So um, we'll talk about the shoe briefly. We'll talk about, you know, the resale price, the retail price. They haven't told us the release date yet. So I think that will become more apparent as the release date gets closer. But one thing we can say is this is definitely going to sell out and it's definitely going to make some money as well. Um, so one thing I do like is the colorway is very simple, straightforward. Uh, would I change anything as such? Probably not. Not even the laces as well. So you've got the, um, you know, one thing which stands out for me is I think the back, which says by any means necessary and the no love as well. I mean, the rest is just pretty much, you know, just box standard what you get from your Nike SB Dunk Highs, apart from the, um, on the tongue there at the top, you can see you got Supreme and the Swoosh as well, but the Supreme's actually been, I think, sort of stitched on there. So it's actually, uh, the board has been stitched, you know, um, and then you've got the Swoosh in the middle. That's a nice touch as well. Uh, the tongue comes in that black color and it matches the toe box, but then the, uh, the toe cap is actually that white. Uh, one thing I've got to say about, you know, uh, Nike Dunk Highs is the very fragile in terms of the leather and the finish sometimes can not be as fine as a Jordan 1. So just be aware of that. Um, so we'll scroll down. Apparently it's meant to come also in a red and that like uh, midnight blue color. But I prefer the first one than this one. But I suppose you can get both of them and then use, you know, both of them, you know, as you want to. Um, yeah, the, the red one is okay, but I just prefer the first one. So we'll scroll down and focus more on the first one. So that's the back there. So it says Supreme Team at the top there. If you can notice, that's been stitched on as well. That's a nice little touch as well. Then you've also got by any means necessary as well. That's in a different font size. That's in a different font type. I'm not sure what the font is called. But all you artists, gurus, make sure you comment down below what font type that is. Um, that's the best part of the shoe, to be fair for me, personally speaking. 
let's just try and scroll down oh now we're talking now the inside's got the soup then obviously the you know the other one's got the prim on that side as well so i do love that as well i do like the little touches sometimes it's what's not seen by everybody but what you see as the buyer you know it, it's something which is so nice i can see a lot of people taking pictures like this as well um so yeah that should be pretty nice i think these will come out on sneakers they will also come out on supreme as well the website itself but you know the bots are going to take everything aren't they as they always do so it's going to be a pretty interesting fall yeah that's the side profile there beautiful 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 so how would you style this like what what the, the, what would you wear with this um i'd probably say i'm thinking more like you know uh black cargo pants maybe like a white like you know either like a white and black jacket puffer jacket style sort of like maybe uh a north face puffer jacket the 700 series if you can get like a black and white one that'll be vibes definitely i think it looks sick um even all black with this as well and this pops and brings the white as well that'll bring the color as well it's uh one of those shoes that you know, i think which if you wear you know i think you know people will just know that you're wearing supreme straight away and i think supreme is it, it, it's a banger they've made a banger here so in the uk when we say they've made a banger it means they've made it a nice shoe so yeah so resale wise i'll say this will probably like uh retail for 115 pounds then resell for maybe three four hundred pounds give or take and the price will go up over time as well so if you can get this on resale after it comes out whereas the price is still not too high then do get it because once it goes up it's gonna go up baby you know supreme dunks always sell out it's not even a question so yeah i'm out guys thanks for watching it's been great and i'm out i piss